Hello and welcome to today's video. We are going to demonstrate how to access some of the basic, more common features of the ONX580 XDSL function. Loading XDSL testing application, accessing H logs, changing XDSL interface, changing from ADSL to VDSL and vice versa. At the home screen, tap on DSL and then tap on XDSL single icon. Modern booting takes 15 to 20 seconds. Idle maybe for another 5 to 10 seconds. Depending on the quality of the line, initializing may be as quick as 10 seconds or as long as 2 minutes. Once you have achieved sync, you will be shown the summary landing page. From here, you can tap on the other tabs to show errors, DSL RTX, signal parameters, bands, and identity, which shows the aspects of the unit that you're using. From here, you can access H logs by pressing on DSL graphs and tapping on H logs on the top corner. From here, you can also compare your bits per tone against your signal to noise ratio or quiet line noise. On the bottom, you can access your modem settings by going into test and settings. And the DSL interface, you can change between testing from RJ45 interface or your red and black test leads. Under XDSL technology, you can change whether you want to test ADSL, VDSL, or leave as auto. Auto is the default setting, but it also makes your modem take longer to achieve sync. You can also change the interface type by tapping the top corner of the screen.